two Michael Jordan cards that are flying under the radar. You guys got to watch this. Brian, to shot! What's up to all my sports card collectors, Jets Mamba back with another video. If you guys are new to the channel and you guys are into those budget buys and you want to know which card to invest in, well, this is a channel for you. On today's video, guys, I mean, what can I say? I have another, actually I have two Michael Jordan cards for you guys that are just flying under the radar. Really, you know, there's no hype behind it. When I'm buying these cards, I'm just like, I don't get it because these cards are just beautiful cards, guys. And of course, Michael Jordan investing in them, you can't go wrong. And out of all the players, man, I've just been focusing on Michael Jordan and just building up my collection, my investments with this guy because his value is just gonna go up later. So the two cards that I'm talking about, guys, it comes from an undervalued set that no one is talking about. It's from the 1991-92 Upper Deck. Guys, it's the first year that Upper Deck came out with basketball cards. So the two cards that I'm talking about, guys, it's these two right here. The two Michael Jordan holograms from the 91-92 Upper Deck set. Card numbers are AW1 and AW4. Now guys, if you think about it, these are the first Michael Jordan hologram cards. And it comes from the first year that Upper Deck made NBA cards. So that, that just gives it a ton of value. And in this set, they have nine hologram cards and two of them are Michael Jordan. So we're gonna pull up eBay and look at how much they're going for. All right, so if you look at it now, you see a PSA 10 for the AW4 sold for 304, guys. And the next one went for 372. And then the AW1 sold for 750 best offer. And then another AW4 sold for 399, guys. Now, let's pull up the buy it now for the cards. So if you're looking to buy it now raw, the cheapest ones are going for six to seven dollars each, guys. Again, so what I'm doing is I'm buying them raw and I'm gonna send them to PSA. If they get a PSA 10, the value just skyrockets. If you guys want another budget buy, what about the base card? Card number 44. This is Michael Jordan's first year upper deck card. It's a beautiful card, actually. I like the fact that he's in his uh, black six infrareds. Let's look up how much these go for. So if you look up the base cards, they're going for $4 each, guys. If you guys are looking for a budget investment, I would go for the first holograms of Michael Jordan. For this card too, card number 44, the base card. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope I was able to show you guys some budget buys of Michael Jordan cards. You don't necessarily have to spend thousands of dollars to invest in them. You can go for the budget buys, buy them low, then later on get them graded or sit on them for a little bit. Eventually the trend, people are gonna catch up and realize like, hey, we need to get on those 91 Jordans, the hologram and the base card. And then what happens? Card goes up. All right, guys, make sure you stay tuned for my next episode. Peace.